Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. And how are you today? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Here's the daily crumb to help you along your way. <coughs> way. <laughs> Choking on my own saliva here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day this is for you. Welcome to the daily crumb with me. Wingish Nibay, Mijanki Kwe, your friendly, freaky ass, sweet grass wild of medicine woman, also Christiana Carr, Chris Carr, superstar. All oh, this beautiful divine being right here. Welcome. All you beautiful divine beings. Right here too. How goes it with you? Yeah, it is. Okay, it's still morning now. This time it's going on to 10 o'clock today. So it's a little later than what I usually do these. Oh, uh, yeah. And then I got an appointment, so I got to get out of here. And I maxed out my credit cards again. I was able to put a little small payment on there. Just to max it out again so I can make some medicine. So I will be making some medicine today. Oh. Yes. And I did that because I was able to get a gift card for groceries and stuff. So it's like kind of rationalizing it in my head. But I need this medicine. It helps. <laughs> Instead of trying to suffer. I've been suffering. Well, I guess we can choose the suffering and keep focused on it and then dwell. And blah, 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 blah. I don't know. I take, I have a hyper vigilance for taking responsibility, even all the stuff done to me. You know, if I made different drugs, blah, 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 even as a child and whatever, but I was made responsible for things too. It's really what my responsibility. But, you know. When you're going through those cycles of abuse, I have a lot more understanding of what my mother went through too. But hey, we get to choose. Do we get bitter? Or do we feel the bitter and grow wiser? Or do we just go, well, if we can't beat them, then join them? How is that how we're helped? Huh? Maybe in some ways it is. It's a survival tactic. But right, those things that we used to do to survive, it's not going to help us thrive. Maybe it's holding us back now. I don't know. What's up for you? Huh? Here. Let's be here. No. It was a rainy day in Peterborough. So thank you. Prayers for rain. The rain dances were helping. It's been rain, rain yesterday. It's been raining. It's raining right now. I love the rain. Love the rain. Love it. I love it. Yes, I do. Especially when thunder and lightning comes too. Ooh. <laughs> uh, uh, okay what's this to be yourself in a world that is constantly trying to make you something else is the greatest accomplishment what yes Ralph Waldo Emerson where's Waldo I don't think it's the same guy I think I say that every time <laughs> Where's Waldo? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> and Waldo's just himself, right? You just you just can't find him, but he's just himself. <laughs> oh, yeah, right? Emotional stuff really drains you. It really, really does, but it's good. It's good. It's good. Good release, right? Anyway, to be yourself in a world constantly trying to make you something else is the greatest accomplishment. Heed your inner calling. What is it that makes you different from others? And what unique expression do you most desire in this life? Whoa, isn't that what we're all about here? Beginning with in and finding. What did this little one and me when they grow up? Well, this little is me, right? You're little. I don't know. I think we got that straight out. I don't know. Hopefully we got that straight out too. What's this one? 31. That's a four. Ow. Force is about the balance thing, right? Let's balance that out. We've been so long, but well, we're not. Let's. Hey, what would it be like to be just simply who we are? Uh, uh, I think it's Mike Posner. I said that. I mentioned that. Be who you are. I think it's a guy called Mike Posner. J 
just be who you are. Um, it's a good song, good song. But, but just be who you are. And what would that be? What would it look like if you were just you, fully, holy, and completely? Who are you? Uh, right? Truly. Not who they send you, or but who are you? Mm hmm. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out who I am, okay? <laughs> what is me and what is me that just learned to be this way because that's what others say. Even when it comes to the tomboys, talking to a friend the other day going, you know, I always love to wear dresses and stuff like that. You know, I wear shorts, but, you know, I'd still be out there doing the cartwheels and flipping off the bars and playing the sports and all that, but I'd have my skirt on. Shorts and stuff under there, but that eventually that wore away because, well, that wasn't appropriate. Here we are, the fear. The fear, do we conform to things because we're afraid of that attack? Huh? Or is there, do you have imposter syndrome? <gasps> People are going to find out that I'm really still just a child. I'm just a great big kid. I got this adult body on here, but I'm still this little tiny kid. Afraid of everything, but want to explore everything. Curious about everything. Right? What's the numbers on that? We have 03. That's our self-expression. Are we afraid to express ourselves? What is that part? Right? The two longest to be longest to be whatever but you've been afraid to show in oh and how would it feel if you could just let that out just let it go let it flow be you right are you afraid of all the you know opinions i know that says options right everybody's gonna have an opinion so just be you just be you don't hold back don't hold back be you fully holy and true in here Right? We look at those reflections. It's reflected in the world around us. What, what do we see? What do we see in others? Because those things that we admire in others, it's also in us. Those things that we don't like in others, also in us as well. So what's being reflected back to us? And maybe it wasn't a reflection, but maybe it was somebody's projection. Right? Somebody projected onto us their qualities, and we thought that was us. We thought that wasn't a reflection, but it's not. I don't know. What is that for you? There's a magic when we can sort that out. Raven is all about magic oh it's magic when i'm with you is that the police oh it's magic just to be you fully holy and true you can do it see you through it all the veils all the lies Don't hide behind a disguise. Open up your eyes. <laughs> Be you, fully holy and true. Beautiful, beautiful beings. Thank you. Thank you for being you. Right? Okay, so look at those reflections. Hey, somebody said, uh, okay, take a look at that tree. Four, five, six, is there a five, six, or that's how we know this is a four, too, right? And that one was a, what was that one? Seven, okay, here we go. Expression, expression, oh, here's owls. We're pulling back those veils and seeing who we are. Taking off our mask, look at that. There's a top and bottom on there again. The way she up. Introspection, see who we are, right? Who we, we get to choose who we are. Nobody gets to choose that for us. All right. Biggest heart hugs ever. Thank you for being you. Shine your light through in everything you do because you know what this world needs you to be you. Fully holy and true. Don't let the world miss out and all it's you. I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you choose to stay. Thank you. Thank you, beautiful beings. Have a wonderful, blessed day. Mwah. Love you. Thank you. <laughs>